thunder storms produce heavy rain, damaging wind, hail and a tsunami. A very small tsunami, one caused by the weather and not an earthquake. Meteorologist Lauren Casey is in the CBS 3 Weather Center to tell us about last night's meteor tsunami. Lauren, everyone wants to know, well, what is that? I know, crazy sounding. I mean, we have the coolest words in weather, do mm -hmm. we not? Mm -hmm. Meteo tsunami, that's what it's called, and it occurred along the Jersey coast last night. A meteo tsunami is similar in form to its earthquake-generated counterpart, but instead is caused by a rapid change in air pressure that is typically associated with a fast-moving line of thunderstorms. As a meteo tsunami races toward shore, the waves can be amplified by a shallow continental shelf or some other coastal feature. As last night's storms moved offshore, the Atlantic City buoy recorded water levels that made a jump of 9.6 inches between 10 p.m. and 10:12, rising from about 3.8 feet to nearly 4.6 feet. And now while a meteor tsunami does not pose a destructive force at the magnitude of a traditional tsunami, this abnormal surge of water and dramatic change in current can be dangerous to boaters, swimmers and beachgoers. The derecho, another cool word in June June 2013 spawned a meteor tsunami that injured two people when they were washed off the Barnegat Light jetty. Mm. So, mm. so interesting. It and the is. meteor tsunami was recorded up and down the mid Atlantic coast from Boston all the way down to Delaware because of those intense storms. Oh, I've never That's heard of that amazing. before. That's, I know. <laughs> yeah. Science, Absolutely. it's cool. It is. It is.